guys you're welcome to my youtube channel today i'll be showing you how to make an electronic pop music using um fl studio 20. the first thing you'd like to do when making this kind of song would be to set your tempo okay so this seems perfect for me now the next thing you want to do um i'm making this beat from scratch so i'm basically just going to take a while and search through my my packs if i could see something really spicy something bumpy to select from maybe a loop and then we'd work from there okay so after searching for a little while we came up with this so just listen to this so obviously you can tell that this is going to be punchy and it has that vibe which we intend to put in the the music we're creating so we'll, basically the next thing to do is we'll start adding other instruments built from there so i'm just going to label this intro that's alternate t for those that do not know that shortcut so yeah let's build from there so i just selected the morphine grand piano to NUC because it has this very very soft sound to it, it's not so aggressive, not so harsh on the ears and I think it would blend with what I have in mind, I don't know, I'm just thinking, but I think it would. So I'm done adjusting that, um, let's listen to the both of them together. It's perfect it's perfect okay that's one keyboard down I think um, I think this song actually would need something still punchy we have a calm keyboard already so I want something aggressive now so I'll just go to my addictive keys I think I have remember there was a sound somewhere there okay let's let's try this out So there we go, um, after a while, took a while, we have this right here, so let's listen to how it sounds. When you think of this kind of music, the first thing that should come to mind is mad kicks, very very punchy kicks. So let's let's get searching for our kicks okay so we've gotten two kicks so we'll just play around with it try around with it it's it's basically a club kind of music so the kick doesn't have to be very tricky it doesn't have to be so mad just right click and feel each four steps that's all you have to do on both kicks let's listen to the first I like this because it has this weight to it, but I want it to be more punchy, so this would back it up. Next up, I think it's best I just probably start looking for sounds to fill this music up. Yeah, so it's going to take a while. I'm just going to, I'm probably going to skip through it when I'm editing the video, so. Okay, so everything, this is everything that we'll be using for the song. It's time to add more instruments, more sounds to it. Bearing in mind that this is an electronic music, you would have to know that it would be needing a lot of arpeggiators. So, um, I'll just search through. Um, Nexus is very good and rich when it comes to arpeggiators and stuff like that, sequences and fields. So, we're using the Nexus plugin. Good. You can see that um, this particular expansion is loaded with arpeggiators and bars, pads, leads, and all of that. If you can lay your hands on it, it would be really nice, and it has re it's really punchy, and it's it's got a lot that would be that would be very useful for this kind of music. 
So um, let's go. I think I probably got to know the sounds that I'll be needing for this song. It's just now I just have to play some things on it. Yo, yeah, so just sit back, relax. So for this, let's do this. With this um, arpeggiators, I think it's safe to say the song is already prepared and now it's time to start layering them on a playlist. So basically we have um, our normal, the loops we'll be using, we have the kicks and then we have the arpeggiators, arpeggiators and some other sounds. So basically split by channel and then you have all of them into their individual channels that's where you can place whichever you want whatever you want whatever whichever of the instruments you want you can lift it to any position you want and to move independently and that's the last of them so let's get started So these are the basics to producing an electronic pop music as you can see I've made some adjustments I've done some work on the on the music so drop your comments subscribe to my channel